Hello everyone. Uh, today I would like to show you a firing system from Showen. Uh, uh, you can see the uh, devices on the table. This is the FX Commander and uh, the pyro slaves, two pyro slaves. And uh, this is the pyro adapter. It's for the charging, charging of the pyro slaves as well as for wireless communication between uh, pyro slaves. And also the two cables for the firing system. And uh, now, uh, today I would like to show you three firing modes with the pyro slave. One is the wireless, and uh, another the wireless with the bridge functions, as well as the wired communication. Okay, first I will show you the, the wireless uh, function communication between slaves and the FS commander. Now we uh, power on the FS commander, and then we enter the setting manual to set the wireless settings for the Pyro's FS commander because this uh, settings is very important to match between the Pyro slave and the FS commander. Now we set this FS commander channel 1 and we set the customer ID, for example, we say 0101 and then OK. OK, now then we, uh, we set the save on the Pyro slaves. Okay, now ID is 0101 and uh, channel 1. Address is, we can set this address to, to 00. zero. Okay. And then we set another unit of pyro safe. 0101 zero, one, address 0, 01 and channel 2. Address channel one. Okay. Okay, after finish this finish this, we can go to for example the manual fire. We add a sequence. For example, we firing from start address zero zero to end address zero zero, start point zero, end point for example we say F. F and then we can make it left to right. Okay, in the walls we say if we see 50. And now we can fire in this. We can see the firing here. Uh, if it is fire, then there will be the number, the ignition point will appear here from 0 to 5. F. Okay, now we show you the uh, pilot reach function of the FX to the pilot slave. And uh, for this function, uh, we need the uh, FS commander and uh, it communicated with the pilot adapter through the wireless and the pilot adapter uh, is the uh, wired communication with this pilot slave. We call this slave is a bridge. And then this bridge pilot slave will communicate with this pilot slave wirelessly. And uh, in this way we should set the same ID between the FS commander and the pilot slave, they, uh, they set the same ID, channel 2, 0102, and for this slave, it is the same. Uh, channel 2, 0102. And then we set this, uh, we set this pilot slave to bridge mode. Okay, first, adjust 01, channel, channel 1, 0101, and uh, this one is not should be bridge. You can see receiver bridge and bridge. Okay. And then we set the same customer ID and channel of this pilot slave the same as the bridge slave. Okay, we can see here the address zero zero is okay and the one is channel channel one. And the customer ID should be the same as the one zero one zero one. And uh, this wireless mode is wireless receiver. Okay. And now we can we can fire in this uh, pyro slave. This here. 
the address is zero zero, and then we can see how it works. Okay, now we try the uh, wired mode. And in this mode, we should connect the uh, pyro adapter with the pyro slaves with this kinds of table. Uh, tables from this bus out. Okay. This table to the, to the bus in of the pyro slave. These are connected, and then the uh, communication mode is the FS commander uh, connect with this pyro adapter through the wireless communication, and then the pyro adapter with the cable connection with the pyro slaves. And in this way, we should set the, the same channel and the, the custom ID, the same between FS commander and the pyro, pyro adapter. For example, now here uh, we set channel two. And custom ID we say zero one zero two. Okay. Okay. Zero one. Zero two. So. Channel two zero one zero two. Okay. Okay. Now we uh, we can fire in this system uh, with this wired way. And uh, for example, we are wire, we are firing this. We can also make it group. Fire on. And the next. 